Bill Keyes, Operations General Manager for Buck Knives. Okay, what we have here is just some modifications and reintroductions of a few things, some changes. Uh, the Spitfires, new last year, again, became one of our top 10 selling products. Its first year, great, you know, great response to it. Really, what we're showing here is just a new color here and a new color, new spacer color on the gray version. One of the unique things about it is because it's all aluminum, we can mix and match the colors between the spacer and the, the handle, so it gives a little bit of contrast in it. The, uh, the Rush, very popular assisted opener for us. We've changed the handle design, updated it for this year, as well as updated the colors and the finish. Previously it was a bright finish, bright anodized finish. What you see here is a essentially a bead blasted anodized finish. So it gives it a, a, actually a richer look, different look, actually gives it a little bit of feel too. You can actually feel a little bit of difference and a little bit of grip to it, which is nice. Um, and this one here, again, introduction last year, part of our Hoods Wood series, the Thug. What we did last year when we initially introduced it, we used a hollow brush on it. Most of our other Thug products, excuse me, not Thug products, Hoods Woods products, are flat ground. And through a lot of field research, a lot of requests from people that, that are part of the Hoods Woods group, um, we went back to, or not back to, we went to a flat grind this year. The benefit of a flat grind, obviously, it's a stronger grind. A little tougher to sharpen, but it is a stronger blade. Uh, and what we found out is the things people put this through, they like the flat grind. So what we've done is gone to the flat grind.